Good morning YouTube. I just want to give you an update with my panel meter, uh, the PCM-061. What I did with it. It's here. Uh, let me just plug it in. well lighted it has a backlight very good for uh, viewing uh, let's see how it works okay before that it has uh, voltage current power and energy on its screen Let's see how it works. I'm going to plug my charger for this uh, small uh, drill, screw drill, and let's plug it in and see what happens. Okay, it's charging. See the light? and it draws 2.5 watts at 0 0.02 amps and you see the uh, grid voltage 232 volts okay uh, let's plug another one Let's test this. Here is another charger. It's for a Black and Decker cordless drill. And see, it draws 3.4 watts at 0 0.1 amps. Okay, let me just put this aside. Uh, I already did a testing for my other appliances. So, here it is. Uh, I tested my 32 inches TV, LCD TV. Uh, on standby, it draws 0 0.29 to 0 0.33 watts. When you power it on, it draws 29.33 watts. Uh, for my laptop, a Lenovo, it draws 50 to 52 watts. Uh, I got a small night pan and it draws 14.33 watts. And a bug supper, it's 0.91 watts. And even the small lighted extension, even when you don't have something plug in it, it draws a little bit power. It draws 0.31 watts. And an ordinary electric pan, on a BC, I'm not promoting it, but it's just what I have. At number one setting, it draws 54.14 watts. And at number two 57.74 watts and at number three it draws 63.99 watts so this device is very helpful to monitor how much power you're drawing and getting from the utility uh, this can also give you an idea how you can conserve and how you can save uh, energy so this energy here the energy indicator is for the accumulative consumption you will see it how much 
what they just uh, you have used for uh, a length of time and you will know then uh, I just want to show you the back I'll just turn it up and I'll just show you the wiring what I did with it I'll just turn it up Here is what it looks like at the back. See, uh, the diagram is upside down. Okay, I just follow the diagram. I, I this is the the lid that goes to your outlet. Okay, sorry. Here it is. Goes to your outlet, and then okay, this is the uh, AC monitor from the meter. See the two yellow wires connected there. Let's see, look just uh, in parallel with the with the line, and uh, this is the choke or what do you call that coil to read the amp to monitor the amp, amp draw okay so I put a zip tie here so that it will not move so um, I think this is the, the best time that show you this before I put something in the, to cover this at the back okay that's a simple wiring just follow the diagram I just use this thin aluminum sheet that I found my junk piles and this one so it, it looks like wow, what a kilowatt meter <laughs> oh. okay so that's it I just want to share with you guys what I did with it and I think it's going to be useful and I'm going to use this as a monitor for a grid tie inverter that I got and I want to show you that grid tie in the next video thank you for watching